What's up, brothers? The Big Sensei back with another banger. Today's episode, we got some R3 speed. Let's get it. The rank 20 right off the rip, eh? I have not played in like a week, so hopefully this goes well for us. Let's see what guided access on real quick. Boom, boom. If you don't know what guided access is, basically on mobile, it just makes it so I don't like accidentally swipe down the notification center or something like that. So it's kind of nice to have. Um, all right. This is a very fast paced game mode. We're playing R3 speed, so we got to really lock in right away. Make sure we're on our A game. He's going to leak a lot more than us because he didn't go for the Niner. But he does get centuries pre-placed for round four, round two, which is kind of nice. But anyways, boys, if you guys are new to the channel or just haven't done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button for us. Helps out the channel immensely and gets us closer to 100,000 subs. I know I haven't been posting much. I uh, just really haven't really had the drive to, to be honest. So I don't really think there's anything wrong with that. Just kind of doing my own thing. Like life's, life's going well. Like I, Definitely nothing like holding me back from uploading it's just like i guess motivation slash desire to even play this game and that's kind of that i'm just like th this shouldn't be my main priority in life right now like this isn't a full-time job for me anything just upload for fun i don't owe anybody anything um when it comes to balloons so just kind of hear how we are and i'm interpreting the situation but still always good to just jump on play some uh, arenas right now like i rarely am free for this arena but i actually had today off work so I'm able to play Vortex Storm, which is super exciting. Probably one of my favorite boss arenas. Now, this should be a good time. I actually almost queued while on my ZMG Superdome account, so that would have been really awkward. But, I mean, I guess it would technically be the same. Like, I think I could get a really, I think I could get an 80% win rate with an only Vortex Storm for 100 games. I think it's possible, but we're sticking to ZMG Superdome. Okay, so let's, let's see what our loadout is first of all. And when can I stop, or when should I stop egoing? Probably around here. Let's see, we have budget balloons. Do I just want to burn one right now? We're going to do it, actually. We're going to budget balloons, literally just to get eco. He's probably going to do the same. And this is actually going to start to overwhelm us. Why did he budget balloons and then send me... Okay, there he goes. We're going to struggle here, low-key. So I need to get up another uh, Niner. Mr. Niner. And I think we'll still leak a little bit, but this is fine. Okay. So now we're in the situation where we need to get lead popping power, which is going to be a balloon trap, actually. So I like my balloon trap, like, right here. Let's see what he does. Is he going for a trap adapter? Or no? Like, if he sends me leads, we'll be able to afford by then. So he's going to send leads. That's fine. So we can sell that, sell that for 3400 So yeah, we can afford trap right now. Let's go for it. Get us some monies. And what do I want to do next? I like my balloon trap spot better than his. Like, his just hits the track right here. Whereas the balloons go around this middle circle twice. So it actually just basically doubles my balloon trap um, time to hit the balloons, right? So he's just ecoing into my trap. That's fine. I'm fine just playing a little bit passive right now. We might be able to sneak a camel rush through too. I'm thinking that. Let's see. Do I want to go for a second trap adapter? He's setting up something. I don't really have... I mean, like, this spot's okay. We can do that. He's going to budget balloons me. We should be able to defend everything with double uh, balloon trap here. Like, I'm shocked. I'd be shocked if this doesn't defend. This should defend literally everything. We can camo shred here since he's, like, all outing. But this should just defend everything. And let's see if I'm correct. Yep, so we're good. Beautiful. So now we're going to rush him here. And we're going to quick shot. And he's going to boost. Fine. I think we just infinite Q zebras here. What is he doing? Is he dead? Let's just budget balloon zebras infinitely. I think he just gets overwhelmed here. Plus, we can layer some, like, tanks over the top, but that should be Jeej. And is it Jeej, or is he just fine? There's no way. No, he gets overran. Yep. GG, man. All right. And that's the power of the balloon trap. And I honestly, I think we mainly won that game. Well, I guess we defended his massive rush, but that was because we used a good balloon trap spot. All right. I'm only going to be playing for, like, 20 minutes because uh, I got plans after in, like, 20 minutes. Well, I guess... Dude, I literally just showered and I'm sitting in my freaking. Uh, never mind. <laughs> Let's get it. But we are fresh out the shower, baby. We got Seesaw. This dude is very good player when he wants to be. He doesn't really try that hard, I feel like. He goes very like meme strat-y type things. All right, let's see how this tax spot does for us. I think all of the tax should hit the map once we get this up to the blade shooter. Let's see. What are our powers here, by the way? We got Power Lock. We have Crowded. No, that's Jam Packed. And then we have Range Boost. Range Boost is interesting. 
Very interesting. Um, it doesn't really affect like Heli, obviously, but like a Ring of Fire with range boost is gonna be pretty good. Obviously, it's gonna be weak to camos, but and then we can make our ninjas basically have like almost full map coverage. Let's get faster shooting here. I think is this the optimal tax spot? I feel like everything hits the map, so this should just be like the best tax spot, right? It should be optimal. And it goes around that double center bend twice, so this just makes sense to use. And I think we'll be fine until around six yellows. We might get a little overrun then. So we'll probably have to go for, hmm, what do I want to go for? Honestly, Tax Bear got buffed recently. We could go for one of those. And I think I might place it in a spot where it'll kind of just be like a bailout, like ring of fire spot in case some like balloons sneak through. Let's plan on that. Uh, he's saving up for a big yellow rush. No, he's just ecoing. Okay. Do we want to try? He's leaking. Do we want to try a little layer here going into round six? Worth a shot. Let's try it. He's saving up money. I don't know if he's about to go for like a ring of fire or something. How much money does he really have? He might jam pack rush me right here. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna power lock. So let's just go for. I'll just go for another blade. He's gonna jam pack. This shouldn't do anything. I mean, is it a good rush? Uh, I don't know. He's literally all outing me. What are you doing? Why are you all outing me? Wait, never mind. He's just being weird. What are you do- This- I told you, he's weird, man. This dude's a funky player. Let's just jam pack this at him. I'm sure he can afford a ring of fire if he wants to, but... Let's put the pressure on him. Oh, his range boost is going. That doesn't really do too much. And now we can send him leads. He can send me leads, obviously, as well, but... Let's go like this, and then we're gonna sell you... I guess we go for, like, a Roth right here. I want it in the center. Regions just don't really make sense here. Is this a good spot? Uh, I feel like it's bad. I mean, it does solo, but I still feel like it's bad. Um, okay, so now we save up. There's a good chance he all outs me around 12 with camos or something, in which case we want to probably establish supply lines and counter. And that's likely what we're going to do. Like against non camos, we're fine because we get either Maelstrom or do something like that. But let's. Do we want to go for a heli here? Hmm. Or do we want to go for a ninja? Like, ninja's viable as well. Yeah, I'm going to go for a flash bomb. He's going for a heli. I don't know, actually. I think both are fine. Let's go for that. And then... Yeah, he might send, like, camo leads. Region camo leads. That's so expensive, though. Like, he's just setting himself up to die if he tries something like that, right? Let's see if he rushes. If he rushes right here, we can afford Sabo, so... Completely fine. Let's send a camo lead, I guess. I'm fine eco in a little bit here, I think. Let's see what he does. Is he sending a ceramic? No. Um, I'm gonna get a heli placed with camo, just so we have that. Because I don't want him to like sneak a camo ceramic through. This way we can easily get a bit like a downdraft or something, you know? Okay, so we're both just ecoing. Um This is where I think I just go like this. Let's see how he handles this. Oh, I power locked too late. Not that the range boost is really going to do too much. He'll be fine, but we force sell and boost. Like, that's fine. We can still defend a counter as well. He's face falling, but we're fine, dude. We're completely fine, man. Like, you just, why'd you just get up a ring of fire for no reason just now? Like, what? Now we just wait for round 18 BFBs. You might send me a Moab right here. No, he's not. Yeah, my ring of fire spot's not ideal, but with range boost, it's obviously gonna hit everything, but. So I think we just both send each other BFBs next round. Do we just go for downdraft spam? Is that the play? Um, Let's go for like two tax sprayers and then, yeah, let's send this. Let's go for a D draft. And I guess we probably go for another one. We don't need to power lock him here. Do we ever try any cheeky rush behind this? I don't think so. Let's see how he plays this. I guess we can... Uh, his ring of, He's probably going to sell that ring of fire, right? He's going to sabo it. Is he going to counter then? Is he going for an Apache? What is he going for here? He's going for Jitsus. Interesting. And a range boost. I mean, his sabo's about to wear off in like two seconds. So yeah, that's full speed, buddy. That's full speed, brother! That is a full speed of my brother! He's get the Sabo off. He's going to have to have Maelstrom now. We go like Power Lock. This is an expensive rush, but... Fine. 
Let's see what he goes for. This might layer like crazy, actually. He might die. That's gonna regen like crazy, I'm pretty certain. Yeah, you're dead. Unless you're affording a patch. Swag on him. Swag on him. See ya, see ya, see ya, buddy. See ya, buddy. I'm sorry, brother. GG. GG. Alrighty. Like I said, gonna be a little bit of a shorter video, probably around 20 minutes, but some good game so far, I feel like. Very, very nice. We like that a lot. Alright, we have... Machi? Um, Machi? Maki? I don't know. We got Tower Blindness, which is like the most annoying power in the game. One of them. There's Salted Wounds, and we have some sort of balloon... Big balloon busty thingy. This guy's not too good. Should be easy claps, bro. Should be easy claps. I've been DCing a lot of people, so I'm not on the leaderboard, I guess. I guess I did play a little bit earlier in the week, huh? Alright, anyways, let's get it. We're gonna start with the Darling here. I think that's the right play. He's gonna start with a Wiz, fair enough. Get the Darling summoned to the battlefield. The reason I go Darling here as opposed to Wiz, well, A, it's just better, and B, we just get impacted by the Tower Blindness a little bit less, because it doesn't really affect Darling at all. Sure, the Lightning doesn't really get impacted by Tower Blindness much either, but let's go ahead and send him a bunch of pinks. We should be able to afford this, like, almost perfectly in a second all right come on afford oh salted wounds i forgot we have that power we're gonna use that as well that should be free lives here hopefully no way he's just fine what okay i failed my salted wounds it's a sad day for us now we're behind an eco honestly i literally just forgot that we have like bros we went for an advance intel oh, if i lose to this guy that, that that's just skill issue that's just skill issue if we lose to this guy no offense, but you're going for an advanced intel, my guy. Come on, now. All right, do we try blacks here? Is that ever overwhelm? Okay, he might send me a big rush right here that might do a lot of damage. So let's go for a fireball. We just need that or else we're just going to die. So, okay, he, he got airburst darts on it. So now he's good. His defense is solid. We have to worry about round six. So I think I just go for a lightning now. Prioritize that. We can't even afford it yet. Because we can't let him get a full salted. If he gets a free 100 eco, like, that's just so bad. We want him to burn a salted. He's going to tower blindness. Okay, hit the balloons. No way. We actually might leak here. Burn your salted, man. Burn it. Burn it, buddy. Yeah, he's going to burn it. Okay, we should be fine here. I think we can no lives lost this, right? Please? We're at 128. Let's see. Are we good? I think we no lives lost. Yes, so we got him to burn a salted. That's really good. Assassin, if we well done. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you. I don't think we can even get anything past him, but... Um, do we just go reactor round 11? Ah, the tower blinds is going to be so annoying, though. I think we have to go... We definitely have an eco lead now, even though we got assaulted on us, right? He's going for a reactor plus extra deep. Yeah, he has not been ecoing much at all. All right, let's save up for a reactor. Um, we want to stall the rounds out if possible, since we have an eco lead. Like, the longer the rounds, the more money advantage we get on him. I'm so... Dude, it's so... Tower Blinds is so annoying. I just know it's going to end up getting us killed here. Um, okay, what is that, Rush? Tower Blindness me, buddy. Do it. If he does, I sell my reactor and get this guy up. Okay, we're fine. Um, let's try something. I don't think it'll work, but it's worth a try. So, we Tower Blindness now. Does it even work? Oh, it works! Oh my gosh, that's OP. GG, buddy. Ah, uh, that's just a mean salted man. <laughs> that's just mean. That's mean, bro. I told you, that power is so annoying. Poor Maki, man. GG. We'll play one more game. One more for the boys. You heard? Alright, what the heck? Ninja Farm Mortar. And we have Morgan. Good luck, buddy. We got some sort of fertile soil, we got slow, and we got long tower, or long bloom boost, it appears. Good luck. Kind of a wonky loadout. I think you start, you can start with a mortar here, but I think Nina starts probably a little better, just so you have kind of coverage against pink balloon rushes. He's also space equaling, which I think is a bit odd. Because you get eco at an accelerated rate, so I think just sending as much group balloon eco as you can just will be nice in the long run but as i say that i'm gonna balloon boost pinks at him because he went for a mortar so he's just gonna struggle a lot here and might just die actually so we're gonna long slow him as well 
And I think this is just going to be a quick GG, but we'll see. We will see. Okay, he's doing way better than I thought he would, so nicely done. Let's just go for this. We'll be fine against pinks because we have a double shot now. Which is why I like the ninja start. He's going to long slow. That shouldn't do anything. Should be easy claps. He's going to... We might struggle next round, though. Two green rushes. So I'm going to stop. I'm going to start space equaling now to save up because round six, a big yellow rush can be really problematic with the long our, our balloon boost and the long slow. We have to kind of keep that in mind, but I'm going to go for a quick farm here because he's not rushing me and we'll fertile soil right here. Get that or better soil, I guess, just to get some quick monies. But I think we save up money now to get ready for a big round six rush. But if he goes for a farm right here, then I'm not really worried. Okay, is he going to do it? You got to rush me, buddy. Yeah, he's going to long slow. So I waited to get my mortar down before he long slowed. Or after he long slowed so that my mortar's not long slowed. So this mortar's shooting at normal attack speed. And we should just be absolutely chilling. I should just defend. Perfect. So we're going to long bloom boost at him. And... Uh, I think we actually can sell our farm here. It's fine. Because this is going to be really deadly. I think he is... Mmm... Is Morgan going to be fine here? I don't know, buddy. Maybe. He sells a farm? Or what did he sell? Is he fine? I think he's dead, bro. You're dead. Yeah, Jeej. All right, we got time for one more. We got time for one more. That was quick. That was only a two-minute game. So, I guess conclusion there was... I don't really know. I, just, I guess just play better. <laughs> Not toxic, just facts, you know? All right, final game. What do we got? Why so serious? Oh, my man's is almost all in. He's got 35,000 out of his 35,727 meds. He's going to sad him up for sure. Just wait. This is a free read. Easiest read of my life, sad him out. Nope, it's a knuckles. All right, we'll toss you one back. Fair enough. But my man's got almost everything on the line. And this could be a very quick game based on this loadout. I'd say it's most lacking group popping power, so... We do have damage boost and lightning, which are two defensive powers. So technically we have like six lines of defense when it comes to powers, but you do have to counter Carotid Blooms as well. So good luck, have fun, Mr. Why So Serious. Let's have ourselves a day. All right. Oh, that ninja skin looks so weird to me. I never really see it like that. Okay. Face Ballman, hopefully himself for being bad, but we'll see. We are Bing vibing, and he's space ecoing for some reason. You're about to send me like Okay, he's going to send pinks. That's fine. Put you on strong here quickly. And we'll get to just seeking shuriken. He's got a double shot. I guess I should get my double shot as well now. He's just space equaling, trying to dwindle my live count at an early rate here, it looks like. But once you get double shot, we're fine. We can afford that now. So not a bad rush to start the game on his end. I'll be honest. He's playing decently well. He got some lives on me. But he did slow his eco down by sending all this space eco. All right, we're going to be just ecoing here. I think round six, we we'll probably plan on just damage boosting and using a lightning and just, you know, greeting for some extra eco here. I think it's fine because it's going to pay itself off in the long run. So if we like we have six boosts, like I said, like that's so many. And like if we damage boost and it wears off and he's still rushing us. Oh, guess what? We just lightning. So he's got he's burned his first lightning just now. Keep that in mind. He's got double the amount of defense we have, though, so we have to I'm going to be careful here against large yellow rushes. So I'm going to start to get up my second double shot. And then eventually we'll get, um, we'll sell the double shot and do a, yeah. So this is just a lightning spot, I think. And this should solo his rush. I think he's used two crowd of balloons already as well. Uh, honestly, we didn't even really need that lightning. It's kind of a small baby rush. We have leads next round. That's when we get sniper on the battlefield. He's saving up quite a bit of money over there. Not sure what he's scheming, but we're just gonna our sniper down. Is he going for a flash bomb? No, why are you going for double shot army, brother? Yeah, he sells it. They get a village. What is going on? Oh no, buddy. GG, man. All right. Hope you guys did enjoy today's video. JK, he's gonna use a lightning here. Yep, there's the lightning. Nicely played. Face bombing. Now we just stop ecoing. Um, does he just all out me around 11? If he does. What do we do, man? What do we do, brother? I guess we go semi-auto. Oh, he's gonna... What is this rush? This is a massive rush. Let's go semi-auto. 
Bada boom, bada pow. I'm not really worried about a big rush because we can sell this for 0 0.50. Yeah, we're fine, dude. Do we want to rush right now? I'm going to go for... We go for a village? I kind of like playing this passive. It's more fun. Let's go for a village. If he rushes, we got 0 0.50. I mean, we could just save up for a sniper farm, but eco's just better. Yeah, let's just eco here. If you all out, sell a double shot, get up the 0 0.50. And then on boost, that should defend everything. Not worried, baby. So he's not ecoing. I think he's saving it. Oh, he went for a blue jitsu. That's why. He's getting up more defense. Oh, he's got his sniper on first, I'm pretty sure. Bro, that is a rookie mistake. It's definitely... I'm like, why is he struggling so much? This is sniper's on first, man. Hey, dingus. He's selling something? Uh, are we about to get sent big ceramic rush? Goes for a sniper farm. Okay, let's balloon rush here. Um, I don't think he's going to really like this. And I think he's dead. Oh, he's got one more lightning. I forgot. I still think Eco's just better. Because if we get eco at an accelerated rate in this game, you don't get sniper farms at an accelerated rate. You know what I mean? Now, I think we just turtle up, though, because round 18 BFBs, he would die to a BFB right now. But if he sends me one, which I think he did, it can get out of hand real quick. So let's see. He's going to send a BFB. If he does, I go 0.50. I'll probably end up selling it for a Sabo. Okay, he's just not rushing. Whoa, do I just send him a BFB, bro? He's got a Sabo. He's just dead to a BFB. Like, his ceramic popping power is just so bad. How are you leaking? What is going on, brother? Do we want to just greed for a sniper farm right now? I mean... Screw it. Let's do it. If he rushes, he rushes, you know? I kind of just want to defend something cool. I don't really care if we lose. I just want to go for a sick defend now. But this guy doesn't rush. As I say that, he rushes right now. All right, so here's how you play this. You go Sabo Supply Line. You go this guy first, damage boost, and this just defends, I think. Don't quote me on that. We can burn lightnings here as well. We're gonna have to re-Sabo though. Um, okay, re-Sabo. Boom, lightning. Whoops. I think we're dead. Sell that. Um, now this defends, right? Yeah, we defended. GG, buddy. Sorry. Alright, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Remember to drop a like below. Hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.